The city of Lexington broke a record that is not cause for celebration. There were 29 homicides in 2019, breaking the previous record of 28. But police don't want you to worry about your safety in the city. LEX 18's Alex Valverde tells us why. Lexington police started off the new year arresting Anthony Essay and Dylan Stewart in connection with the murder of 57-year-old Donald Foster. But Foster's death happened a few days earlier on December 29th, and his murder brought the total number of homicides in Lexington for 2019 up to 29, a new record. But Lexington police say no matter the number, their approach is the same. Our investigative approach doesn't change whether we're dealing with 30 homicides, 15, or even one. Um, we're always going to be approaching it with looking for as much information as possible. The number of non-fatal shootings also increased from 79 in 2018 to 110 in 2019. It, it is unfortunate that people choose to take a firearm to settle a dispute. Even though the number of homicides increased in 2019, the department says that overall crime has decreased. We're a very safe community for a city of our size. Overall crime in Lexington in 2019 was down from the previous year. Same thing for 2018. Crime in 2018 was down from 2017. And looking ahead, the department hopes the community will continue to help them and provide information when crimes happen. In Lexington, Alex Valverde, LEX 18 News. Two men who are charged with murder and dumping a man's body in Washington County appeared in court today. 18-year-old Anthony Essay and 19-year-old Dylan Stewart pleaded not guilty to their charges. Essay is charged with murder. Both are accused of evidence tampering. Police say the murder happened on Sunday at an apartment on Augusta Court. They say Essay and the victim, 57-year-old Donald Foster, got into an argument that turned violent. Investigators say Essay and Stewart took Foster's body to rural Washington County. They'll be back in court next Tuesday.